Part two, the video just cut off. Child, when I tell you there was an ending, this high priestess ain't no joke. The world, it's over. She does not have time for this. Somebody tried to tarnish her image because when I first pulled her cards, somebody was like, whoever this person is, they could know that she's into spirituality. She could have read something into this person's energy. She could have said, you're doing something to betray me. Be careful with me. You know, I'm helping you out. I care about you. There's something that you're not telling me. Whatever this is, this high priestess knew that this would come to the surface. Okay? Whatever this is. Mm-hmm. And somebody found out that whoever they were dealing with was not worth dealing with, okay? Chicago, Illinois could be significant, I just heard. Mm, mm, mm. Gary, Indiana. Oakland, California. Clarify, Holy Spirit. What the heck is going on here? Sticks and stones may break your bones. Somebody could have tried to hurt this person, literally, with something, a weapon, to hurt them. Somebody's under the influence. Somebody's hurt, distressed. Uh, they want to control, dominate. They're mad because this person has a spiritual calling. So it's almost like I see somebody saying really nasty things to somebody. Like you're not, you know, you're not a high priestess or you playing with those cards or you're doing this and this and this. Like somebody really wanted to destroy somebody verbally. Sticks and stones, yeah. And then the way that this person wanted to present this person was a false prophet, a false teacher. Clarify what's going on. This person could have grabbed this person by the arm. I'm getting something to my left side. Like somebody saying, come here. This was like the last straw. This pushed this person so far away. Somebody's ancestors do not play about them. Eight of cups. Somebody's about to relocate. Yeah, some type of fight. I can't make it up. Five of swords. This person got very belligerent, violent. <laughs> Clarify the eight of cups, please and thank you. Yeah. About the money that they owe, Knight of Pentacles. I'm sorry, the Nine of Pentacles. But really, this is supposed to come out in the upright spirit is saying somebody is now going from being attached to somebody to being single. But in the reverse, look, this card just fell down. And right up under that is conflict. Somebody grabbed the high priestess, the empress child, and you about to get your ass waxed, drug addict or not. Somebody's, somebody's ancestors don't play about them. Nine of Pentacles. Somebody single as a Pringle, walking away as guided by their ancestors. This person is dangerous and this person knows it. Yeah, listen, somebody knows that this person's got some type of mental issues. Drug-induced psychosis is what I just heard from doing too many drugs. Somebody's brain is fried, but they still think they got it going on. It's not no bad looking guy though. King of Pentacles to the Queen of Pentacles, they can have money, but somebody's still an addict. It doesn't matter the amount of money. At the same time, somebody could have been borrowing money from this high priestess because they didn't want their wife to know that they had these addictions or to calculate where the money was coming from. Something like that. Child, what happened here? Yeah, I can't make this up. I cannot make this up. Seven of Swords. Somebody was sneaky and deceptive, using drugs behind somebody's back. Then they got exposed with the sun. It's like the lights came on. What was done in the dark was being exposed. This was heartbreaking for everybody involved. Not just the wife, but, but for the person that was the, the friend. Somebody was a friend to this person. And somebody thought that it, it could be more. Maybe this is my person. Somebody is not, I need to make this clear. Somebody is not side piece energy. They're not signing up to be a side piece. There was some type of misunderstanding of what it is that they were getting involved in. Somebody was sneaky and deceptive and withheld information. They could have told this person that they were already divorced. Or maybe they didn't explain the reason why they were about to be divorced, which is because of what they were doing in secret. Somebody decided to walk away and let bygones be bygones, surrendered that shit to the universe and kept it pushing. Somebody's birthday could be in August with the sun. Leo energy, nine of pentacles, Virgo energy. But if I just read the energy, eight of cups, somebody got their emotions together. Somebody got into the queen of swords energy. Seven of swords is Aquarius energy, Gemini energy, Libra energy, air energy, swords are energy. Somebody had a head over heart decision about their emotions. They burn that shit with the sun, use their fire. Okay, this is about clearing your heart. Leo represents the heart. Nine of pentacles is Virgo energy. Somebody's birthday is in August. And then the three of swords, somebody cleared their heart chakra. Somebody was like, oh, well, I got this lesson. And this was not easy. 
four of cups. They could have consulted with their ancestors, seven of wands, and their ancestors was like, this person ain't spiritually protected. Get the hell away from this person. Seven of wands, this is their ancestors talking to them. Big Leo energy, four of cups. This was not easy. Water sign energy, their emotions were all over the place because they care very deeply for this person. Although they are surrendering this person, somebody knows that this is divine intervention, that they have to do this by way of their ancestors. The four of cups, this was not easy. It's not easy when you care for somebody that's addicted and you want to believe everything that they say, but this person's coming up as a high priestess. Remember in the previous spread, somebody had the devil, the seven of cups, illusions, addictions, the fool energy. They just hopping around, figuring it out, not thinking about any consequences. Because they're numbing themselves to the capacity that they don't understand the situation and, and, and what's really going on here. Like, yo, listen, you need to get away from that high priestess. That's a chosen one. You need to get away from that high priestess. You can't talk to that person any kind of way. You can't just go grabbing that person like that. Somebody got violent when they realized they couldn't be in this person's energy anymore. Seven of Wands. I can't make this up. This is a fall from grace. Temperance in the reverse. Child, somebody got cursed. Somebody is cursed. But somebody's listening to their ancestors. Because remember, the seven of wands was in the reverse. Whoever this addict is, whoever this person is bound to the whatever they're addicted to, could be money, things, whatever. They don't have any spiritual protection with temperance in the reverse. Somebody lied over and over and over and over and over again. Mm -mm -mm. Somebody tried to come at this person verbally, say nasty things. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt me. Type of an energy. Then they came back after they got themselves together. This person is on an emotional roller coaster. They're up, they're down, they're all over the place. Knight of Cups energy. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. You know, I was upset. I'm mad. And they come back. And then it's like, well, F you. Blah, 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 blah. Somebody's all over the place with their emotions. And somebody, confirmation. And somebody was very, very patient. High priestess energy, interest energy. Somebody was very loving and kind and patient until they had to make a decision. Two of Wands. Your, their ancestors was like, you better make this damn decision. We got to get the hell up out of here. We ain't got time to be pussyfooting around with him and what he got going on or whatever he's bound to. Eight of Wands energy. Somebody had to make a swift decision. This person could be relocating right now. Child, somebody could be out of, out of here by way of October the 1st, honey. Nine of Pentacles. This person's still coming in. But I'm sorry, you know, I didn't mean it. This person knows the type of energy that they're dealing with. Somebody, whoever this high priestess is, they're very intuitive. You cannot play over their top. They're directly connected. Whatever you try to speak over them, whatever you try to say to them, child, you are going to be heavily in regret. Ten of Pentacles, somebody is being provided for so they can move forward. If this person was having money issues or whatever this was, this high priestess was going through, her ancestors are providing her with money so that she can relocate. This person comes from a royal freaking lineage. Stop playing around. Whoever this other person is, they are grieving the loss of this person. Somebody did not know the last time was the last time. I just heard every weapon formed against this person will not prosper. This is about self-love. This was a lesson of self-love. And somebody showed love to the capacity that it damn near took them out. This high priestess learned a really hard lesson. She's very, very protected, very powerful. Her lessons do not negate the fact that she's anointed and blessed. And this person tried to talk about your spirituality, wanted people to see you in a certain light, but still wanted you to give to them. It don't work like that, sir, ma'am, it, whatever, six of pentacles. They wanted something from you. Somebody's all over the place. Somebody's like a child. Yeah, the chariot. This person is moving forward. The cherry, ain't nobody got time for that. This person could have been driving over to this person's house, begging, lend me, loan me, let me have, robbing Peter to pay Paul, trying to keep something away from a queen of pentacles who was their wife, because there's money there. Queen of pentacles, king of pentacles is financial stability. It's 944 on the clock. Somebody thought this was their divine masculine. 
until they realized that they were dealing with an addict and they didn't realize that, oh, this is just a lesson. Yeah, listen, somebody didn't know they was in a third party situation. Baby, somebody was lying. Ooh, we. That's why when you meet these people, be that a woman or a masculine. Well, what's your situation? Oh, you know, I'm going through something. We get a divorce and this and that. Okay. Somebody really believed what somebody said because they didn't have any other reason to think otherwise. Not only that, they're connected to their spirit team. So somebody's like, okay, that's cool. This is what you're telling me. This is what it is. So guess what? You're keeping it a thousand. You're keeping it a buck. I'm going to consult with my spirit team because if there's anything that you're hiding by way of the seven of swords, they're going to tell me. So I'm going to take what you're saying for face value. I cannot make this shit up. You fooling with a high priestess. Child, she was not concerned about your lies. She knew that at some point something was going to be revealed to her and it absolutely was right on time. Stop playing with the play. Somebody was playing around, child. Lying, four wands. She realized this was not her twin flame, but a karmic situation. And even if this was a twin, somebody had a chance to get something from her. Even if it was just loyalty, honesty, Something to awaken this person's soul. This is giving me 11, 11 on the clock. Somebody could have been this person's twin. It turned karmic. Somebody didn't want to let go of their addictions. Mm, mm, mm. Clarify. This person got divine intervention. This is a divine being. This person is heavily protected. This person's got angels all around them. Their ancestors don't play about them. And somebody tried to play them like a fool. Again, they're still coming up as the empress, child, caring, loving, and kind. Somebody's a leader, a teacher. They care for people. They're very nice, very sweet, very loving. And their spirit team is guiding them the hell away from this bullshit with the fool. They're going to provide the money. This person's getting some money. This person's going to travel and or get away from whatever this is. And somebody's not going to see them ever again with the fool. They're trusting in their ancestors, two of pentacles, to transmute this bullshit. Death, they've gone through a full transformation. They're deading a situation. This was not easy for this person. Ten of Wands, this was hard for this high priestess. You know why? Because this person is all around watching, could be following them, trying to see where they, where they are. This person was guided to guard themselves. Nine of Wands energy, they're coming up as the wounded warrior. Something almost took this high priestess out until her ancestors said, look, you have done your job. We need you to go. And somebody's being obedient in the two of wands. Child, this person tried to hurt a high priestess. He tried to grab a high priestess. Yeah, a star. This person could be in the public eye. Something about wanting to reconcile, but this person's going towards their new beginning. This is beautiful energy, and there's good news about money. Somebody needed something in order to go to the next level, so they could have consulted with their ancestors. Like, look, I need some money so I can relocate. Child, somebody went to their altar, dropped a prayer, the ancestor said, say less. We got you. You just keep doing the work. You got a new beginning coming here. And you're going to leave this person out in the five of pentacles. Do you understand? That means do not look back. These are instructions that somebody's ancestors gave them. Somebody had to get king of swords and real masculine against somebody that they wanted to stay in their femininity with. Child, this is the message. I didn't think the message was going to get this long, but it's only 13 minutes. Baby, we got a lot done in a short amount of time. And I feel like whoever this high priestess is, she's getting a lot done in a short amount of time. She's watching herself. She's protecting her energy because this person is lurking around and she's going to move in silence. Child, she's about to move so swift. She might move in the middle of the dog all night. Mm -mm -mm. Somebody looked up like, damn, I didn't know she moved. They look next door. They're like, damn, what did she pack up? Somebody's been packing up slowly, child, for the last two weeks. Putting a little bit in their car. People don't see them moving too much. They're cleaning up that old place so they can get their deposit, child. High priestess stuff. Listen, ain't nobody got time for that. Close this door, spirit, please, and thank you. Judgment has been called down on this situation and the circumstance, and that's just what it is. I love y'all. I'll see you soon in the next video. Drop a heart down below. Show some love. I'll see you soon. Peace be with you.